Hi folks, today I was at 7 Mile Market in Kuching and I wanted to share with you some things I bought there. That's by far not everything I bought today on the market, but they ate all the other things. Like I bought a big durian that I shared it with the people from the coconut stand. For that they gave me one free coconut. I drank the coconut, I bought two more coconuts, I bought a, a cocoa fruit, I bought and tried a lot of other fruit, but I ate all that. Then I bought some pieces of unripe durian and had some nice people make me a durian soup from that. Well, and this is the stuff I brought home to the National Park of Cuba, where I'm living right now. So let's see what we got here. A lot of tasty mangosteen. Some grow Michel bananas. This used to be the normal banana on the world market until a couple decades ago. Some Pisang Hotel. That's the normal banana around here. Some Dabai or Bordeaux Olive. This is actually more like a vegetable. You have to boil it before you eat it and then it's like more or less like a avocado. Some rambutan, red and yellow. Pulazan, the Bordeaux cousin of the rambutan, which is usually tastier, but actually it depends on the plant. But I, like most people in Bordeaux, prefer the pulazan. The tampoi, Bacaurea macrocarpa. In the uh, Indonesian part of Borneo, like in Kalimantan, they call it Kepul. Here is the Rolinia. Uh, some people hype it a lot, so it's very rare, but basically on the markets in Malaysia and Indonesia, it's one of the more common Anona species. Three Champedaks and one little tarap. I say little because they had some for sale which were twice the size. The champarax and the tarap, I want to eat the flesh and later I want to boil the seeds because they can be eaten, boiled or roasted. Actually we have a barbecue here. If I knew this I would have brought a lot more plants with big seeds because there is a lot of seeds you can roast or boil. But yeah, that's basically what you can get the average day or an average Bordeaux market. I think all this stuff cost me less than 10 euro in total. Now I just have to eat it. The bananas, the bunches fell apart too early in the car. What a pity. Okay, folks, I gotta finish this video and then I gotta go into the jungle and try to find myself some wild fruit because here I have a really severe lack of fruit, as you can see. Haha. <laughs> Well, stay tuned for more fruit videos from the jungles of Borneo. Now I'm really in a decent jungle. This is quite an undisturbed one. So stay tuned for more fruit videos from the jungles and markets and sometimes even restaurants of Borneo. And don't forget to like, share, comment and subscribe.